What's going on, guys? And welcome back to some more Five Nights at Freddy's The Killer in Purple. And today I'm back into the game because, as you guys can tell, well, I guess you can't tell because in the top right, it says we're on version 1.0, but we're actually on version 1.1, a brand new version of the game. Thanks to the developer, he sent me it a little bit early here, and from what I heard, it's got some crazy new features, but not only that, apparently he's going to be sending over another version of the game later on today, and it's going to have even more features. So, what I figured I'd do is let's go ahead and read through his email, and let's see what this update's going to have in store for us, and then, of course, let's play through it in today's video, and let's have a blast. So, he says, so this new update has some more stuff. I fixed the kid counter when ending your shift. I fixed that you could fall through the floor beneath the map. You can now interact far away. Rexter's icon has a new sound. William has the ability to help, or a new ability that helps you start when you first play by having a 50% chance of giving you one point for free the trust upgrade in the shop is fixed it will show up as empty though but nothing to worry about i added an extras menu for when you beat the game which is really cool i added a new easter egg so don't come too close to into the pit spring bonnie and then they put a bunch of winky faces and smiley faces so yeah you guys know we're gonna have to go up close to pit spring bonnie we have to and most important of all i made a working third person third person view of every character which works with gameplay interaction and movement so have fun with the bug free one version 1.1 of killer and purple it's actually version 1.0 but just to make it easy for you guys i made it 1.1 so you guys heard it from the developer himself right there he said don't get too close to into the pit spring body so let's go ahead and press play and let's get too close to into the pit spring body we have to do it you guys know we have to so who should we do it as though let's go ahead and do it as entered because we have yet to play as entered so this should be a fun one Oh, man, I am excited, but also nervous at the same time because we might end up inside of Into the Pit Spring Bonnie's mouth. I, I think so. Because um, you guys remember, it, when, I, when I first got that Easter egg, one thing I mentioned, I was like, you know what would be really cool? If he just picked you up and ate you. So I, I have a feeling that's probably what he's going to do. Oh, look, do we have little arcade machines now? Chica's Party and then BB's Air Adventure. Oh, dude, these are from FNAF 3, aren't they? Oh, it's been forever since I played that one. Two for FNAF, yeah, FNAF 3. And then we've got Take Cake, or Take Cake. <laughs> Take cake to the children, and then you've got boxing. Go, go, go. Oh, man, dude, these are sick. All right, so let's go ahead and approach. So I think to get this to activate, I think we have to do this again. We have to touch Daco. So we have to wait for Okay, so he's going to come out of the ball pit, and let's see what happens here. Now, he said don't get too close, so we're, we're going to have to get too. Oh, dude, he actually eats you. <laughs> he actually eats you. You lost all your points. That That's actually a thing now. He just he straight up swallows you whole. All right. Yeah, I like that. I like that a lot. So I would be interested, though, if we could bring a child next to it and see what happens. Oh, guys, I forgot to get rid of my score from the last video. All right. Well, that's fine. We'll only use what we get in this video, even though a lot of you guys are telling me you don't mind. So I guess we can go and use these points. And then for the next one, we'll just get rid of them because we, we'd have basically this amount of points anyways, um, because it's super easy to get points now. So we're going to go and purchase the scooper and Vanny. And that's it right now. Oh, and an alarm clock. I forgot about that. Wait, what does that do? Oh. <gasps> Oh, uh-oh. What did I... Okay. Let's press... No, that does nothing. I'm pressing the, the little teddy bear. Ooh. Okay, that's creepy. Let's leave. Oh, I clicked it. Oh, my God. What is this? I had no idea. Oh, what is happening? Whoa. Okay. Talk about a secret. I'm playing as the developer. I'm pretty sure this is his little Golden Freddy icon. What the heck, dude? We're in the glitched out world like in Help Wanted. Why do we just have to follow the gold circles, I guess? Holy moly, this is so cool. What the heck? All right, let's follow it into the kitchen. Hello? Dude, this is insane. What is this? Okay, okay, it's taking me to it's taking me through the map. So we have the shadow animatronics right there, just like in my game. Take a look at this, though. Shadow Bonnie. Holy, look at his eyes. All right, so it wants me to go this way, but we, we got to explore a little bit. I want to see if there's anything else crazy going on in here. So this is like some glitch trap stuff. Like, he's in the game. He's messing with us, or Vanny or, or something is messing with us, for sure. All right, let's keep going down here, and let's just get to the sister location, I guess. I have a feeling that's probably where it's taking us. Okay, look at the plushies on the... Oh, my gosh, dude. This looks great, though. <gasps> okay. Yep, it's... No, it's down at the sister location. I don't want to go. We have to do it, though, guys. We got to jump into the pit, dude. Here we go. Oh, my gosh. All right. We're into the sister location. Uh, giant clock? Is that is that normal? Okay. 
a bunch of gold coins going around it. Activate the alarm clock. Okay, wait, hold on a minute. Before we do that, I gotta check out... <gasps> dude, this is the scooper. So this is what we just bought, guys. This is the new scooper. Oh my... Dude, that's so crazy. That is awesome. Okay, so do we have anything else in here before we activate this alarm clock? It doesn't look like it, so... Let's see what happens, guys. I, I don't have a good feeling about this, though. Oh, no. Is someone gonna spawn in or something? <gasps> what the heck? Wait, what? <gasps> it's too- What a horrible nightmare. It's too dark, I can't see. Oh, no. All these things in my nightmare. They were all so weird. But they were all connected to the murder case that I've been working on for over 10 years now. But there's one thing off about all of this. Everything was connected to the case. Except one thing. And his name is Goldie. I need to discuss this with my best friend Mark. Maybe he knows something. Oh, wait, so the games are connected? Because Mark was from the other game. What the heck is happening? Hello, with Jim? Hey, it's me. Mark, I was asking if you're still working on that murder case from back in the 80s. Yeah, why? I just found something. Yeah, that see, this is the same ridiculous. intro from the other game. Really? Ah. How did you get in? It so doesn't matter right now. You need to come right now. Oh, okay. I'll be there in like yep. nine. That, that's the exact intro from, uh, what was it, Into the 80s? Or it might have been the other, I don't know. I can't remember the name of the other game, though, that we played. There's so many FNAF fan games I, I play. I hope you guys understand. <laughs> Killer and Wait, so that's the ending for the game. Oh, okay. So I'm pretty sure this music's going to be copyrighted. So I'm going to have to skip through this. But wow, that was cool. Oh, guys, look at this. Okay, so I sat through the, the entire thing in Five Nights at Freddy's back in the 80s. So, yep, that's exactly what I thought. This game is connected to the game in the house that we played. I'm pretty sure. And that might have been the intro for the first. I don't know. We played so many of his games at this point. But wow, so that was definitely a pretty crazy secret. I mean... I wasn't expecting that. When I saw a clock, I thought it meant like FNAF 4. So I thought that's where we were going to go. But instead being able to play as little Golden Freddy, <laughs> little Golden Freddy cinema, walking around and stuff like that. That was pretty awesome. Only thing I wish was that we could see that cutscene a little bit brighter because it was really dark. And I think it was only dark like that because of the graphic settings. But anyways, let's go ahead and try out Ennard. And let's hop back into the sister location and start scooping some children. All right, let's do this. <laughs> let's begin. All right, it's weird because... I, that, that whole cutscene stuff like that, I, I was expecting to go straight in and start, you know, our normal typical stuff of just, you know, having kids, luring kids into the back room and putting them in suits. But no, we got to see that whole cutscene and stuff, which is pretty cool. All right, so who wants to follow? Oh, yeah, I forgot I'm entered. Let's see what this looks like. So I am the renovated entered or whatever you want to call it. The, the one where I have a suit, all right? <laughs> Usually I don't got a suit, but this time I got a suit. And uh, it says I have an ability, but it's just baby's ability, I guess. So let's see what happens here, which makes sense. Well, let's see if I press Q, what happens. So... Q, does it still do the little golden hat thing? No. Come, little children. Huh. I prepared a party. Okay, I don't know. Oh, wait, no, I don't want to end my shift. All right, so whatever. Let's just let's just get him to follow me because I don't want to try using my ability and then accidentally glitching out the game again because from what he told me, if I do that with Glitch Trap, it's even more buggy. So, yeah, we got to be careful for that. <laughs> We don't want to glitch out the game too hard, that's for sure. Oh, and by the way, guys, we've been growing so fast, and I just want to say thank you guys so much for that. I mean, the FNAF hype this year, every year, it's it's huge. But this year, it seems to be the biggest that we've had just because it's a PlayStation 5 game and all that kind of crazy stuff. So welcome to all the new people. And if you're one of those new people that haven't already subscribed, do so right away because, trust me, you don't want to miss the upcoming FNAF content, especially if you're at this part of the video. There's, there's going to be some good stuff coming up, so be sure to just destroy that subscribe button. All right, guys, come on. Where are the children at? Hello? Hello? Guys, you're stuck. Get over here. Should we try? Nah, I was going to say, should we try to get the pit spring money to swallow one of them? But I don't think he would do it because I think he would only do it to us. But because I guess we could try it. All right, let's see what happens. So I'm going to press this and I'm going to back up. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, let's see. Look, look, look. They're, they're right on top of him. So if this is going to work, it's going to work now. Let's see. No, it doesn't do it. So you have to be like right on top of him, unfortunately. But that's still, it's still really cool. Regardless, just to see our animatronic get swallowed up. Okay, well, see you guys around. <laughs> they weren't coming, but now they wanted to follow. <laughs> they were stuck on the ball pit for like 20 minutes. And the, well, the one time I get in the elevator, now they all want to follow me. Are you kidding me, bro? Are you kidding me? All right, well, we're back in the sister location. So you know what that means. Copyrighted music. All right, so guys, who wants to follow me? Come on. You, you, no, okay, you. Whoa. What? What is that voice? 
Oh. Wait, so our voice changes whenever we enter the sister location because we're entered? If that's the case, that's really cool. What the heck? Dude, we have a creepy voice. Oh, no. Not this again. Holy. All right. They just sling slingshotted me across the map. I'll take it, though. I got unstuck, so I'm happy. Okay, so how many do we have left? We need all of them because they're all going to the scooping room. All right, let's get this many for now. I don't want to have too many following me in here. So, come on, guys. Into the giant scooper. <laughs> this thing is huge. Holy moly. <laughs> dude, this thing is massive. I love it, dude. It's awesome. Look at them all, dude. They don't stand... Like, them compared to this machine, they're like little ants. Holy moly. Can I go under it? No. Oh, crap. That means I can get stuck here. All right. So, I think this is enough of them. Let's close the door. All right. You, I guess you're coming in, too, and so are you. Okay. So, let's see how many points this is actually going to get me. I have a feeling it's going to be a crazy amount. I mean, we're scooping children. This is going to be... Okay. Let's see. 200... Oh, my gosh. Look at this. It even does the scooping animation. What? Dude, this is so cool. Come on, guys. Look at how many points I have. Oh, my gosh. Wait, so if I stand here, it's going to scoop like me, right? Oh, yeah, you can just get scooped too. Wait, change to baby? Oh, is that what I'm... No, I don't know what's happening. I don't know what my ability is. It's weird, but I can't even... Oh, I can't even use an... Oh, now I can. Oh, okay, so that's what I'm doing. Okay, makes sense now. So I'm switching between entered and baby. I got it. I thought it was like baby's ability where like you got the bonus points. But I didn't see the gold hats on them. That's why I was confused. But now I get it. Okay, so now we're baby. But then if I want to change back to entered, I just have to press it again. What? No, now I'm... I don't know what's happening, dude. <laughs> I have no idea what this character's ability is. All right, let me put away the knife. Nope, put away that. Okay, so we still have uh, about five or six more. So come on, guys. Everyone follow me. Hopefully uh, most of you guys will actually follow me and not run away. There we go. All right, so it looks like we got just about everybody. Yep, we got... Okay, you're stuck. What, how are you stuck? What are you stuck on? Come on. Get out of the speaker. What are you... How are you stuck on the speaker, of all things? Can you move? <laughs> what the heck? They get stuck on the most random things. Like, literally the most random things. A speaker, of all things. Maybe she just really likes the song, all right? She's really digging this copyrighted song. <laughs> She's like, yeah, dude, this is my type of music. All right, so here we go. All right, so we got, like, five more. Here we go. Into the thing. Into the scooper. So this is like an easy 1k points, right? Yep, quick and easy, 100k, or 1k points, that's that's incredible. Alright, let's get out of here now. So, if I wanted to leave, which I wish you could leave through this door, but there's gotta be a reason why you can't. Oh, now I can! Oh, maybe he updated it. I don't know, but that's super convenient. Alright, well we didn't get this one, but hey, now I did. <laughs> oh, run, 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 here they come! Here they come! Get me out of here, get me out of here, hurry! Oh my god, why'd I do that? Alright, look at the views right there. Dude, that was close. Oh, dude, now every time we go to the shop, it's going to be super creepy with the creepy little doll just staring at us and all that stuff. Oh, my. Dude, come on. Bring it back. I want, I want the vanny standing there again. <laughs> the less creepy stuff. Oh, wait. Why am I even in the shop? We bought everything from there. Okay, so let's go ahead and play as another animatronic. So we have Glitchtrap and Vanny. I'm thinking let's do... Oh, I really want to do Vanny, but I really want to do Glitchtrap, too. <laughs> all right, guys, in the comment section down below... Which one of these is your personal favorite? At Glitchtrap or Vanny? Which one do you, would you play as if you had the choice? Me personally, though, I feel like I'm a bigger fan of Glitchtrap. But Vanny's like the new up, up and coming Glitchtrap, so I, I could see the hype around her, too. But we're doing Glitchtrap. Ooh, break the code. Charge delay 60 seconds. Break the code. What? Okay, so let's try that then. Wait, does that mean what I, I think it means? Break the code like the whole game. Maybe the entire map will become like purple, like what we saw before. Whoa. Oh, look. I can see through the wall. Wait, is there anything back here? Oh, no. There's nothing back there. Well, that's cool. You can actually see through the wall. <laughs> what the heck, dude? All right. Who else wants to follow me? You? Okay. Let's get all these guys and then let's try our. Oh, no. Dude, the tables. The only tables in the game that can save you are the, the sister location tables because you can jump over them. These you can't. <laughs> all right. Look, I'm going to have to bring out this knife real quick. Did anyone see that? Only. Three. Okay, you're still following me. <laughs> Dude, I just brought out that right in front of everyone. And even the people that saw it are still following me. Look at this. <laughs> they're running now. They're so excited that they're running. What the heck, dude? All right, well, how many do we got left? Let's go ahead and collect them all. Let's bring them down to the scooper, and uh, let's see how this is going to go. I, I really want to try to bring the entire map down there. I feel like that would be, like, an objective, a goal. Like, that, that would be, like, super hard to do, though. And only because of how crowded everything is. If these maps were just a little bit bigger, or if there was some way of, like, moving the children, <laughs> I could have, like, a whole stockpile of them and just stuff them all into the scooper, which would be so cool. Okay, come on, come on, come on. Oh, look, they're already getting stuck over here. 
Oh, no, it's starting to lag the game. It's starting to lag the game. <laughs> I love the comments where they're like, Fusion Z Gamer has a, has a conga line of children. <laughs> the children. Like, the children do his FPS. Adios. <laughs> like, my FPS just goes bye-bye. It's just gone. My FPS just completely leaves the game. It just says, adios, goodbye, I'm out of here. It just, it never comes back. All right, so we got to hope that they'll actually follow me because this guy, he's running after me. I love it. Okay, so yeah, they're, they're making their way. I just, I got to get them in like a straight line and then I got to like direct them straight down there. They're like a choo-choo train or something, like a train, all right? I've got to just direct them in the proper, the proper pathing. Oh no, 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 no. See, the, the parents are already messing it up, dude. Come on. This way, guys. Oh, I can't look at them. I can't look at them. Whatever I do, just don't look at them. Okay, so I have to look up a little bit. All right, guys, I need everyone in this doorway right now. Everyone in the doorway. Everyone walk. Wa no running, guys. No run. I know you guys are excited to go into the sister location, but no running. All right, come on, guys. Come on, everyone in. All right, so how many do we have now? How many is that? No, there's still more. Dude, come on. Everyone in. <laughs> I think this is as many as we're going to get. I'm pretty sure this is as many because they're stuck on each other. So we're going down, unfortunately. All right, well, I mean, this is a decent amount. We got like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, probably like 10, 12. Who knows? <laughs> You know, I could just count them, but, you know, where's the fun in that? Dude, look at my shadow. Oh, dude, this looks so cool. Look at this. Imagine you're one of these children. You don't know what's happening. You're just going down the elevator with Glitch Trap. <laughs> Come on, guys. Everyone follow me. I'm going to try to get all of them into this room. All of them, all right, at the same time. I don't want no one left out. Every single one of you is going into the scooper room, all right? I want to try to get, like, 500K points from one go. <laughs> I don't think I can even do that. All right, I want to try to get at least 10K points or at 5K. But I feel like we could do 10. But we're going to try for 5. This is so many, though. I don't I don't think I'm going to be able to get them all. Oh, don't look at them. <laughs> don't look at them. Holy moly. Okay, so how many more do we have? We probably have, like, 5 more, right? No, there's one. Oh, my gosh. That is not good. Okay, wait. There's one right there. How am I going to reach her? I said I would get all of them. No. How am I going to? Oh, there we go. Nice. We got them all, I think. Okay, let's see. Yep, that's all of them. All right, guys. Come on this way. Everyone into the back room. Come on. Everyone pile in. I, I don't know how I'm going to do this. I have to hope that they don't get stuck and that they don't block that pathway because I still have to close the door. Oh, my gosh. Wait, don't block me in, guys. Holy, we actually did it. We actually did it. Look at how many of them. Oh, my gosh. We did it, guys. Mission success. All right, everyone in the scooper. Holy, this is going to break my game. Oh, my. Dude, this, the, the noises, the noises. <laughs> it's just my brother laughing nonstop. I love it. All right, dude. Yeah, we're definitely getting 5K. Can we make it to 10? I don't think we can. No, we can't. We can't. We can't. But hey. Oh, maybe we can. There's more over here. All right, dude. Come on. I want to get to at least 10. I think we'll make it to like 7.5, maybe 8. But I mean, hey, I'm, I'm happy with that. Like right now, we don't even need points. I'm in the millions. So <laughs> we're just basically doing this for fun. All right. Well, there we go. We got... Yep. I was right. 7,456. <laughs> I was wrong, but... <laughs> All right, well, let's get out of here, dude. That's a, that's a good, that's that's a lot of points, all right? Come on, that's a lot. <laughs> um, exiting and, oh, wait, I didn't use my ability. Let's try it. Q. Nothing happened. <laughs> what happened? Break the code, dude. I don't know what I just did. Take the, let's go. Let's take the elevator. Nope. Well, I guess we have to go back in for that one because I, <laughs> nothing happened. I, <laughs> I think you probably have to have the children there if I had to take a guess. So let's go back in again. Then we'll do a Vanny game and then we'll go from there. But yeah, I got to see what this ability does for sure. All right. So we have to wait 60 seconds. So I guess while we're waiting for that, let's go and get some children to follow us. I'm hoping that when we press break the code, like something crazy will happen with the children. I don't know what, like maybe they'll glitch out or something or their faces will like glitch out. I don't know. I I'm excited to see what will happen though. Or maybe it's just like for using the knife. I don't know. Let's go ahead and bring them down in the elevator though for now while we wait for the charge delay to end. So come on guys, follow me. I think I got like five of them, so hopefully you guys don't get stuck on anything. Yeah, you guys should be fine. One of them is following without even <laughs> needing for me to say anything to them. All right, there we go. All right, come on, guys. Into the elevator we go. This is a pretty good amount. All right, what is this? Like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, no. The elevator didn't move me. The elevator didn't move me to the middle. Okay, we're fine. I can just go around them. All right, so everyone stay. Don't move, okay? <laughs> Stare at the wall and do whatever you want to do, all right, until we get to the scooping room. Then you know what's happening. All right, so let's go ahead and get a few of you guys. Let's get like four of them. Let's get five, six. Okay, six of them. All right, let's go ahead and bring them into the back room. And now the charge delay has ended so we can break the code. And let's see what happens here. I'm excited to find out. I'm hoping that it's not... Oh, wait a minute. I just remembered something. The developer, I'm pretty sure in his email he sent me today, he said that Glitztrap has the same problem, but it's actually worse 
then baby. Yeah, okay, so yeah, I know what this does. It's gotta be a point boost then, but let's try it and on one of them, see what happens. So we're gonna use our ability, press it. Oh, no, I only got, no, yeah, nothing. Oh, wait, so then what does this do? Cause look, I'm just getting, yeah, I'm getting the same amount of points. Well, that's confusing. <laughs> I don't know what this ability does. <laughs> break the code. Wait, what if there's a part of the map that you have to break the code and then something happens? Oh, dude, if that's what it is, that would be so cool. Like you have to press Q in a certain area and like it breaks the code of the game and like a wall or a door shows up or something. I bet you that, oh, what if that's what it is? That would be so cool. Cause that, that didn't do anything point wise. Maybe he just told me he delayed it or he, he removed it or something. I don't know. That's weird though. Let's go back up and let's try it one other area because we can use it one more time before we have like a huge delay again. So let's try to use it and run around the P3 and see if we can maybe find something, but I'm not sure what this would do. It probably says it somewhere, but I just missed it, but whatever. Let's find out ourselves, all right? It's more fun to do it this way. All right, so we have 30 more seconds. Let's go ahead and run to this area right here. I wanna run over here. Okay, excuse me, guys, all right? Come on, I'm just trying to get to the other pizzeria. I'm not even having any of you guys follow me, all right? You guys feel lucky right now. All right, move out of the, all right, really, bro? Really, you're, you're asking, you're asking to get in a suit. You are asking for it. Holy, <laughs> I'm trying to play nice and these guys are just asking for it. All right, so we're gonna go and go in here. We're gonna try using our ability here. Then we're gonna run into the bathrooms then run into FNAF 2 and see if we can find anything before that time limit actually runs out because I'm pretty sure. Oh yeah, look, I haven't even looked out here in a while. Dude, that looks so cool. All right, so wait, wait, who's that in the middle? Probably Golden Freddy, his like little cinema eyes. All right, so let's try it again. Q, then run, run. Oh wait, wait, what? Oh, so it is that. It just wasn't working over there. Oh, you know what it probably was? Maybe, it, no, that wouldn't make any sense. I think, no, yeah, it's working on everyone now. Yeah, it is. No, oh, it only works on FNAF 1 children. Okay, well, I guess that makes sense. So wait, let's see how many points we get for this then. Come here. No, what, come here. Are you kidding me? Okay, well, uh, I'm getting busted. Holy, all right, well, I just, look, I just wanted to see how many points it would be. <laughs> That's all. I just wanted to see how many points. All right, you know, maybe it's for the best. He told me it'd probably break my game, so let's just not do that. <laughs> let's just not break the game. All right, so let's go ahead and go in again as Vanny and go from there. Now, we've played as her in the past in the ver the earlier version of the game, but from what I heard, because I saw a little, like, menu in the, in the, what do you call that? <laughs> the, 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 the thing at the end where it says everyone's name. I can't think of the name of that for some reason, but that thingy, it said there's a new Vanny model, so I'm curious... If this is like the new Vayne model or if it's the one from the old version, like just brought over, but that's like a new Vayne model from the older version. I don't know how to describe it. But anyways, it looks like the same one to me. So it's like the new model. Um, so let's go ahead and try to put on the mask here and see what happens. Wait, you can actually put on her mask. Oh, that's so cool. Look at how creepy her mask looks too. That's going to be cool. All right, so we have to wait 28 seconds for this. So let's go ahead and stack up some children then. I'm assuming the mask would just get them to follow us maybe or... I don't know what the mask could do. Because I'm pretty sure the mask is just to, like, trick them, isn't it? I mean, we don't know really what the mask is. It's to communicate with Glitch Trap, but we also don't know exactly, like, what it does physically. So, I guess we're about to find out. Let's go ahead and go into the elevator. And uh, let's try it in the elevator. While we're going down the elevator, I'm going to try pulling out the knife, and we're just going to go to town. All right, well, we only got one of them, but that's fine. All right, so we're going to go ahead and put on the mask. Mask is on. And knife is out. And I can't do anything. Oh, we did it. I only got 10 points, but I have the mask on. Well, we've got about 20 seconds to figure out what's happening. <laughs> 19, 18, please let me out of the elevator. I got to figure out what this does. Okay, what does this do? No, can I pull up the knife in front of them? Oh, wait, is that what it is? No, no, they're running. Wait, can I just do this? What? What is the... Okay, maybe the mask lets me use the knife right in front of everyone and just get rid of the bodies right in front of them, I, I guess. I have no idea. Yeah, look, it ended and now, yep, that's probably what it is. Now they're all running. All right, well, that's interesting. Oh, well, hello, police officer. <laughs> Can I still exit? Oh my gosh, no, I can't exit. Dang it. <laughs> all right, well, guys, I'm gonna end this video here, though. That was the new update for Five Nights at Freddy's Killer in Purple. There's probably gonna be another video on this game tomorrow because like he said, the developer, there's a new update, another update coming. I think it was supposed to come today, but it might come out tomorrow. I have no idea. And he said there's some more stuff in that one. So if you guys are looking forward to another video on this game tomorrow, be sure to destroy that like button on the video. And of course, if you haven't already, destroy that subscribe button too and the little bell icon to your first videos. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.